Coventry City in recent years, but on the up and up, narrowly missing out on an FA Cup final to United and a place in the Premier League to Luton, both on penos. Couldn't hit a barn door with a shotgun from 12 yards? If you don't take your oppos, the vultures are going to begin to circle. Pick the bones out of the squad. And now, after the harsh sacking of Mark Robbins, it's time for a new man to rebuild Coventry City. Take them back to Premier League. Champions League glory. Who better than someone who started their playing career at the Sky Blues, went on to have an illustrious career, and now taking a crack at management? It's Kino back at the Coventry Building Society Arena to take the Sky Blues sky high. Favouring the 4-1-4-1 or the attacking 4-3-3, we're looking to utilise these tech tacs to get the most from this team. Bringing through some Irish youngsters, but also going through some of your suggestions. Looking at the players that we can bring in short term, or even bring back some former stars. I'll chuck in a couple bangers here just to wet your whistle. But don't forget to drop a like on it if you're looking forward. So then finishing this season off with a 3-5-2, starting out at the same points that they are in real life. Mission number one is surviving in the championship. So as always in these rebuilds then, we're going to play a bag full of highlights and then play the big important games live at the end of the season. But if you haven't already, make sure that you get down in the comments section and tell me who I should be giving the rebuild treatment to. So then the first match up against the Baggies and one position that we won't have to strengthen throughout this rebuild. It's between the sticks, Dovin, safer than your balls. Using the Baggy shirt, sponsor Barber Boss, semi-sponsored. But it's the former Baggy, Thomas Asante over to Hadji. And you know this man is going to score more than Diddy at a Justin Bieber gig. I tell you, I thought I was watching Torval all day in the way he skates past defenders at times. And of course, he's got the finish to match. And then in the final games of these highlights, Portsmouth. They get it off, Claire, bless them. But our skipper, our knight of the round table, pulls his sword from his sheath and slices one into the top, Banjo. So a comfortable 14th place finish. Hadji, BTA and Rudoni, our top performers of the season. Best believe we'll have Hadji competing for the top bagsman soon. Start of season two then with 11 mil to spend. The big focus on strengthening the wings. De Silva, you're a bit wank. And I've got my eyes on a former Cov target. So first up, someone I've been wanting to bring in for a while. A tricky winger who loves to slip inside and penetrate deep. He also does it on the pitch. Samuel Adozi, an absolute bargain for four milli. But pulling talent from League One is like pulling a girl from the year below. Fishing a barrel job with players like Kwame Poku knocking around. Dash out a couple of deadwood to raise enough pocket. Because we're looking to bring in a former Channel Wonder Kid. Someone who have almost had their hands on last season. Harrison, back to grace the channel. We know a lot about this boy. So then with season two underway, this term we need to be looking to go straight up by hook or by crook. Playoffs are automatic. We need Premier League football. And early doors, it's the lock pick Arudoni. Finding the run of sheath. Like an ex finding a way to ruin your life. Hole picking up an early goal in this one. I tell you the pace that we've got over the top now. We're putting defences into spliffs the way that we're bunning them. Looking to bring in three of the Irish youth into the team. And it's Clark. He must have been in the Brentford players' ears before the game. Hey, you lads, you had a bunch of idiots. And Burmo and Jensen both see red. Which meant after that, the defence opened up like your mum's legs after a glass of Lambrini. Sammy taking advantage. And yeah, she weren't drunk drunk. Yeah, fully gagging for it. Hadji's ability, though, to be in the right place at the right time. The man could fall out of a plane and still land on a bounty castle. But there's one man in this team who's seen little to no game time but could still work his way through a Nick Comb. Sakamoto with an arrow. I know we're an hour away from Nottingham, but this man's coming like Robin Hood. So they're missing out on the automatics by a hair. It's going to be the lottery of the playoffs. But when has Fabio Cannavaro ever turned up to a Championship Player of the Year ceremony? It's like Keir Starmer giving out timetables rock star certificates. To be fair though, 36 goals in the league is a bit illegal, ain't it? Keir's going to be looking to deport the Yank. Looking to get our own back on Luton in the semis. It's Sammy making a late run into the box and with nothing on, he just shoves it in raw. 1-0 sends us to Wembley to face Brentford in the final. Here we are then, one game away from the promised land. The last fixture against these was an absolute circus, wasn't it? 
But there'll be no clanning around today. Trying to suckle all the honey from the bees. Come on, you skies. Joel. Got to be, got to be stronger. Got to do better. Ben Elwick does it again, though. Nicks it and drives. Can he find him? Had you right. In the middle. Up. Ah, come on. Straight back over the other side. Uh, these long balls aren't working. Not Igor. Not Igor. Not Igor! Ooh, I tell ya. Binks. Ben Elwick. He's inside. Drive there. No one's coming out here. Keep driving. Bank one. Is it one? <laughs> oh my god. He has been incredible. He is one of the best right backs we've tried. One of the best right backs that we've ever had graced the pitch. I'm telling you right now. This man is going to be a Hall of Famer. He's going to be playing Champions League finals very soon. You haven't done anything all season. Go on, bin this one then. Bin it! Oh! Tough! Oh, I was too busy celebrating, not even celebrating. Oh, he's a fan of whipping onto that. But a dozer. Knows how to strike him! Oh, it's opened up for him. It's Mateta. Not back to Igor. Nothing back to Igor. Oh, of course it's back to Igor. The bees draw level. It's poor defending, isn't it? Where you come from? Binks you across. No Igor. It's a great little take. And we go. And we drive. Nice Rodona. Eccles now. Can we find? Sammy Yadozi. We can do. The man who's been on it all season. And I tell you what. He'll be on the Cavossier tonight. Popping bottles. Eccles. With the ball weighted to perfection. And we'll be expecting waiter service tonight. Down in London. Tiger Tiger. Love Tiger Tiger. Great establishment. And Burmo's gone. Got to take him. Got to take him. Igor. It's again. It's a big save. Oh! Oh, no. You haven't. You have not. You ain't just done that. Oh, it's a great save. The second. What the friggin' hell is Eagle doing in the net here? Oh, it was just too big for him, wasn't it? You really, you really should be saving that, though. There was no need. Just catch it. For fuck's sake. Always going down line to Mateta. Thinks that you're knackered, didn't you, son? You really need to come off. Wissa. No! Oh my god, Joel, what are you doing? Don't do it to me. Ball in. Well away. Only to the edge, though. Dam's guard. No, Pinnock! Not Pinnock! Not! Not like this. Brentford have stunned us. Have absolutely stunned us. Gotta make something happen, then, boys. Got to make something happen now. Clarker. Nice little turn. Go on a run. Find. Rodoni. He has. Got to be an handball in there, ref. Got to be an handball. And I ain't got him on, but got to be an handball. Big winner. Well done, Kitch. Thomas Asante. Find that corner! Oh! <sighs> Hadji. He's nicked it. Hadji, you're through. You're through. You're through. You've got to finish it. You've got to finish it, Hadji. What is that? What are you doing? Rodona. Into Sakamoto. Go on then, Hadji. This time. Got to finish it. Oh, my God. He saved us. Hadji, you're making me head implode, not explode. That's going to be when we win the Penos. Come on, boys. We've got to do this on Penos. I can't spend another year in the championship. Please. Please. On to Penos then. And Burmo steps up first. He's binged it. Hadji, come on. You can't miss. You can't miss. You cannot miss. Get in, Hadji! Wissa. Oh, he's dinked it. That's a save. 
Get him, boys. Right. Harrison. Don't let me down. Don't let me down, Harrison. Don't let me down, Harrison. Don't let me down, I said. Igor. Saved it again. Come on. Eccles. Right. Chance to put us one off. Come on, Eccles. Binza. Binza. Easy. Right. Let's just keep it stung now. Mateta. Oh, I thought we'd saved him again. I thought we'd saved another one. Rodoni. Right. Nothing silly. Oh, I've been silly. I've been really silly. Get him, Rodoni. Right. Save this. We're done. Save this. We lift it. Save this. Coventry. In the Prem. Cavalio. Saved him. Oh, you mother. Right then. Thomas Asante. Come on, son. You've been dog. Dog this season. Just do one thing. All I'm asking is one thing. Good penner. Good penner. Good penner! Get in the skies. Ah, oh, Premier League. Jesus Christ. We made it hard. We made it hard for ourselves. Of course we did. Kino and his Sky Blues. Dovin to lift the playoff final. We are Premier League. Say we are Premier League. We are Premier League. Say we are Premier League. So won the jackpot. But this is where the real work starts. So this team, quality all about. But it's strength in depth that worries me. A backup for Hadji, a more attacking minded midfield, and possibly a winger. But if we are going to push on, we need to be without Roof, Sims, De Silva, and Torp. Also, that we could bring in this man, the little Dutch Brazilian magician. Going to be priceless, both ends of the pitch. But uh, if you want to stick a tag on it, it's 8.5 back to the blades. And an intriguing suggestion Stassin from St Etienne was going to provide that little bit of cover for Hadji. But our Boston Bank signing, a winger that's got history in the Prem, it's Luca Colosho, comes in to rotate through with Sammy and Kwame. So our first season in the Prem, three signings, we got enough to keep us up. First game of season three then, we travel down the road to Leicester, good middle of the table team to cut our teeth on. Well, I did have a little niggling thought about Dovin, is he good enough? Do we need a Prem proven? Wow, this one dispelled all the worries. It was save after save from the Swede. And we know if we keep it stum at the back, and we've got a chance to play Hadji in one-on-one, -on -one, it'll leave the defenders gasping for breath like an Asian tourist on Bondi Beach. It was chances after chances that fell to the Foxes late on, but it's the cat to come out on top. Had to leave this one in Binksy, kneecapping someone in the final minutes. Next up, it was Newcastle, I have to say. How much I love Samuel Adoze. This man is like Pedro Pascal. He's in everything. New season, new league. But it's the same old people hating on Clarkie. He'd have been incredible, but for all the times that he'd been chopped down. But our right back, he loves to pick it up, chop it, remix it. Call him Milan Van Eric Eric. Yeah, still don't know his name. Keeper, not going to be able to remember the name of his kids after that one. It's a stunner from our flying Dutchman. But another local derby. The tricky trees, Hadji, the lumberjack, lopping them down early doors. But it's the little jink inside from Gus. He's lit the match, he's chucked it into the bush, and he's set the old forest on fire. Our first trip to see the Gunners, couple half chances early doors, but then Arsenal start to turn the screw. But it's Dovin, equal to most. Taram rounds him and fires into the side netting. And all we have to do, lads, is play it nice and simple. We might come a whack. Yeah. Self-destruct button well and truly tickled. Chasing the game, they slice us wider than 2024 Sami and Nazari. Final game of these highlights, and it's the Toffees looking to make it a sticky one in the first couple minutes. But as the game settles into its flow, looking for someone to stand up and produce a little bit of gold. And it's the time for the Italian to get his bloody noodle out. Slaps it harder than a nice bit of chicken parmesan. So a comfortable 16th place are in the Prem. No messing around with relegation. Hadji grabbing 20 in his first top flight season is a lovely little bit of subtle foreshadowing. Kalosh, Rudoni and Hammer all chipping in. So as we move into season four, it's time to start adding some real quality to this side. Right then, two new centre-backs are a must. Last year, we got passed around like a tin of roses on Jesus' birthday. Sakamoto and Yearn, 
both sacrifice to generate as much as we can. So first of all, bring in the man that pocketed Haaland. Paul Van Ecke. We've maybe been taken from behind paying 27 for him. But Paul's right hand man this season. He's a man that's destined for the Prem sooner rather than later. Former black cat Dan Ballard. Big old blockhead. Let's hope he's not the second coming of Harold Maguire. Fourth season in charge of the skies then. Looking now to kick on and break into the European spots. Having to start taking big scalps. And nicking three points off Liverpool would be an electric start. Van Ecker collecting superstar strikers. Gonna have to start putting him in his little roadman bag. Chances going begging and trying to force the issue in the later stages. Leaving us stumbling around like a Sunday league team after a Christmas night out. Usman bearing down and it's a national slaughtery to snatch it. Looking to pick up three points against Burnley. Hadji Wright could score in a lesbian only brothel. Spuds next and Harrison denied a stunner. Colosio goes for a wonder but he's denied again and then Luca through once more. But he's kept out by his countrymen. And it's once again shot to the heart of Martinez is to blame. We got mashed up by the Spuds. So in the final game of the season against the Hammers, it was just for pride. Left red faced early on. Dovin beaten by another stunner. A dozy forces one past. Yes, that is Edison in nets. But a lovely bit of two touch on the edge of the box leaves Rodoni coming onto it. Look, he's just seen her stumbling out of snobs. 4 a.m. Right for a spanking. Slight improvement from last season. But I think we're missing a bit of magic. Just something to unlock everyone else's full potential. Hadji doing far too much of the heavy lifting. He needs a Robin to his back. So the start of next season, we're shipping on another one of the day ones. Getting that Saudi dollar though. Don't stress about him too much. But all the paper that we have, we're going to get one rolling with Big Ange. Because our Robin, coming like if Luke Little sliced himself in half. The turkey taper himself, James Madison. 39 mil? Have we only signed him? Oh, he's fucking Barbara as well. But we've gone and give Harmer his lucky 38, a dozy 8, so that Mads can have his famous number 10. Now then, season 5, it is imperative that we break into the top 4. And you know, we can always jump on a little cup run. But the big question is, can James Madison be that player to unlock everyone's potential? Well, doesn't take him long to have the defences legs up akimbo. Paul must have got all in his feelings about it though. Gives Morgs a leveller, but Madison picking that ball up in the pocket. Defences expecting him to dig out a ball into the rushing attackers. But Jimmy shapes one like a fresh fade. The prodigal son returns to Cov and it's the bullseye twice on his third debut for the skies. Next stop was Stamford Bridge, Joe Felix putting him into a lead, but it's Hammer to sneak one in at the front post. Sheaf's little bende shepherded away, but in the final moments, Luca lifts one into Jimmy. Less friction on that five head means the glance is just too much for Jorgensen to claw out. Another famous three and the blues are flying. Looking to share the love, Sammy with a little flick over the defender. Not looking to leverage, just shape it into that far corner. Inch perfect, just like the first time my missus saw my boxers around my ankles. Newcastle's turn to turn on the style and pop two past Dovin. But who else? Madison finding pockets like a gypsy in a town centre. These two have become telepathic. Mads could find the lost city of Atlantis. Or oh, Madeline McCann. Yeah, yeah. I know you were waiting for it. Only played this one to score a couple bangers against Norwich, but one up and holding out into the second half had me a little bit all shaky, you know what I'm saying? Fear no more, because the skip is still dishing up bangers like he stood outside of Villa Park on a match day. Any onions? Any ketchup? Mustard? Nah, I'll just have a little bit of whip on it. Whip on it? Yeah, whip, son. Oh, Madison, you're just spoiling us now, kid. I expected you to be good, but this consistency, it's like coming like a muller rice. Perfection. Sin matches in the FA brought us a delicious little semi against Palace. Real chance of the final, but a Palace silencer. But come on, if you're talking about that bit of kit, there's only one man that comes to mind when you mention silencers. Just like our star boy, his name's also James. But as the game settles into a bit of a stalemate, we turn to our forgotten man from the start of the episode, who remembers our youth, Nakano. The Japanese samurai unsheaths his katana and slices a path straight the way through to the final. Is that the best goal that we've scored in FC 25? I think so. So, a couple games left at the end of the season, one being the FA Cup final 
as we have a rematch against last year's semi. Come on, you skies. Time for a proper bit of silver. So here we go then, Kino. FA Cup final. First time we've been here. Jesus Christ. Has to be against the Red Devils, doesn't it? Slightly rotated side. Couple man out injured. Couple man just knacked. Come on, the skies. Come on, you Red Devils. Oh, Boniface has gone early. We were fannying around. Oh, he got fingertips on it as well. But it's not a great start. Boniface has him off the face. She. Driving. Driving. Could it open up for you? Could it open up for you? Streefy gets us back into it. Unbelievable drive. Unbelievable run by the captain. The skipper has dragged us up by our boot tails. Oh, it's the captain. Captain. It won another one then. Oh! Oh, ball to Bonnie Face again. Bonnie Face. Oh, this is a boot face. It's an absolutely stonewaller. Should have finished that, really. And he's gone again. Ball Rose. Something's going to happen here. Hadji! Oh! I saw the net the, uh, uh, I saw the net a rippling and I thought we'd done it. Burrows is gone. Come Burrows. Get that down. Okay, so James Madison. Oh! James Madison again! I, I tell you what, I tell ya, I tell ya, we're gonna snatch this. We are gonna snatch it and we are gonna grab it by the bollocks. Last couple mins. Swing a good one in. Hadji. Up! Saved! Get it down. Burrows. Oh, don't lose it. Oh, don't lose it. Don't you lose it. Wait in. Flick that on. A doozy! Finish! Yes! Oh, he's offside. You absolute mug. You absolute toss pot. You had me. You had me smiling here to here. You had me celebrating like an absolute prat. Oh, he's miles off, to be fair. Coming on the edge. Binksy. Go on, son. It's one. Oh! Binksy! Binksy, Binksy, Binksy. Oh! Me, sir. You, sir. Jar Jar Binks. Could have won it, sir. Oh my god, I'm absolutely gutted about that, Dan. That's probably the one that I'm most gutted about ever. Oh, right then. Penalties. Ah, he sent us. Right, how'd you write? Where are you going? Is he going left? Easy going right. Palacios. Oh, he's dinked it. He saved it! Get in! James. Jimathan. Jimathan Madison. Stick it in. Good lad! Anthony. Oh, mate. He's going to fluff it, isn't he? Oh, no, he ain't. Surprising. Very surprising. Burrows with that short back and absolute what the fuck has gone on there. Got to finish it. Got to stick it away. Well done, Burrows. Let's just go. Let's just go five for five, lads. Mason Mount. Of course, he misses. It could be. It's going to be Eccles. It's going to be the Sheckles to stick it away. And you know what we've got to do. You know what we've got to do. Oh shit. More well, than that. Right, Ponce. Can he miss? Can we save? No, we can't. Oh, no. And now it comes down to this. Oh, it comes down to Nakano. Nakano to seal the FA Cup. He got us here. Win it for us. Win it for us, son. And he does! The youth all the way from being basically 
banished from the squad. Robbie, he didn't rate him. He didn't fancy him. I tell you what, he fancies him now like he's just swore right on Tinder. Here we go then, big skip to lift it. Sheafy. What the fuck has happened here? Apparently we lifted in the Premier League. <laughs> in the words of Ricky and Rory. EA! Sort it out! So with the FA Cup under our belt, final game of the season, we travel to St Mary's with a glimmer of that top four spot. We are a point behind Spuds, but with Southampton in our way and Newcastle in theirs, there is a chance, you know, there is a chance that we can sneak into the top four. Ball in, armour, into a doze. Hit one. Hit one a dozy! Oh, against his former! It's the former Saint. And he's hit one that is truly, truly biblical. Here we go again then. Dozel. Go on, it. another one then. Oh, yeah, another one then! Minutes later! It's a disgusting double. Ah, oh, I tell you what, he's got no respect for his former fans, has he? Straight over to him. See, he's not even gone over to our fans, he's gone over to their fans. Oh, I tell you what, we're absolutely on it now, lads, aren't we? Go on, Adozi. Go on. Do another. Oh! Oh, okay then. James Madison. You're going to go for another. Go right there. And absolutely hit it as hard as you physically possibly can. Right in that top banjo. Right in that top banjo. It won! Oh, Jimmy Mads! Jimmy, it is frigging Mads at this point. His technique coming out of his ring piece. Call it referee. Call it. Call it at 3 a.m. Call it your mommy. Just call it game, set, and match. What does that mean then? Spurs hadn't come up on the thing, but we're going mental. We're going a little bit nutty, you know? Why are we going nutty? Oh, come on. Champions League. Jesus Christ. Have these three died? So, with Champions League football secure next season and Hadji once again missing out on top bags to Ricky Robot. Mate, it's boring now, ain't it? But, unreal season from Mads under his belt. Top assist in the league and 18 goals to his name. So, going into season six and our fifth full Premier League and Champions League glory is certainly on the list. And to help us get there, 114. God, it's about time, ain't it? But now we've got the funds. I know exactly who we're spending it on. Shift us into a top two to accommodate. Oh, let's face it, he's in the thumb. Victor Jokeres back in the sky blue. And don't worry, I'll be putting the number 17 on him. 65 mil though. Seems like chump change to me. So, another return in blue. And as a Villa fan, I'd be nursing a chub when I realised he used to play for Cov. Ian Matson for 50 mil. But after parting ways with a couple, man. All oh, these ones made me feel some type of way, you know. Eccles and Rudoni for 7 and 16 gave us enough dollar for one final signing. Dan Ballard, great lad, but Uncle Mark will help us lock up the madness that's about to fly at us in the champo. 12 plus Slabhead will have this team ready to attack on both fronts. But first in the Community Shield, Sitter. We need to brush teams like this aside now and pepper in Mignon like a nice bit of sirloin. But of course, it's the telepathic two combining once again. And they're just the difference. The win for the Premier League trophy. Oh, we're too many seasons in now. The game's starting to implode. And speaking of the Premier League, Kalash starting to show a bit of the promise that made us splash 20 on him. A dozy with the shank and it's Victor on the scraps. But someone stuck 20p in Fulham. Salamakas to be more specific. But Ark at Hammer. Knows his limitations. Or well, Madison, would you smash it? Pfft, hanging out the back of it. It's a Hadji header to seal the comeback. But then next up, ball mouth. Well, wow, there'll be mouths around some balls after this one. Sammy still producing peaches. 
but the cherries do pop one in. But if you're talking popping off a piece of it, it's a piece of cake for this man to chuck balls in holes at the minute. Honestly, it's like chucking a chipolata down a tunnel. James Madison up against his old best mates in his highlight role at this point. It's just a joke. Someone will be uploading this video to the hub. And you know which hub I'm talking about. Play the first, Jimmy. Different corner. Same result. Next up was Liverpool and Luca Defo giving me something to think about in the RTG save. But Madison, you've got to stop it at this point. Reminds me of that Simpson meme. Stop it, they're already dead. Hadji, like a toddler when his little brother's saying the alphabet for the first time. Robbie, Robbie, look at this. We've seen it all before, son. One thing we ain't seen as of yet, though, is a stadium like this. The Santiago up against the Galacticos. Well, could have been a better start. Couple scares in the first couple mins, but it turns into full-blown nightmares. Has me waking up covered in a substance. And I think it was sweat, but after watching them baps finish here, could have been something else. We need a sniff. We need to believe. And you best start believing in ghost stories, Bazzuno. You're in one. It's Luca to bundle the first, and then Dovin slinging one up to Victor. He's got it down into Sammy, and Sammy back into Jacques. Shows Marquinhos a clean pair of heels, and he goes for a nibble. Hadji steps up, and oh my god, we're believing now. Minutes left on the clock, and it's Quinny. Beaten for pace again, but this time gets it right. We sneak through, which had us a quarter final, 3 2 down to Bayern ever losing. In need of something, in need of a big reaction, and Samuel Adoze, well, he's gonna have his own YouTube channel. You'll never believe this comeback. Well, it could have been if we'd have put one of these golden chances away. But with just minutes remaining, it's Verts to send a German bomber crashing into the back of it, staring down the barrel. Ian decides that he's got something left. But it's Leroy Sane with the goal that really broke me. But like someone's just reached into me briefs and made a fist. So no doubt about it, we need a reaction from kick. Fires back three. Someone slips a bit of night on in your schnitzel, lads. Victor as free as Santa on Boxing Day. And then in extra time, a dozy pops up to snatch it. So then it's a semi with City. Couple half chances for both early doors. But as it opens up here for Colosso, he draws in two defenders to block it like your ex's number. But the ball pops up to Milan and he sends us to Fashion Week. Our day one from Championship Relegation sends us to a Champions League final. Go into our final week on the job and three points ahead of Spurs, but a loss for us and a win for them would mean that they lift it. So our final game of the season, up against the Seagulls. Let's go and steal their chips. So then boys, Premier League almost wrapped up like a nice little Christmas present, but Spuds, three points behind us. Better goal difference. If we do not do the job today, they will do us. They will do us on goal. Come on, boys. Nothing silly at all. We just need to get the big three points. In. And on again. Hammer. Hit one. Oh, big stop from Sherp in early doors. Ball in from Madison then. Hadji rising. Oh, it's the line. Carried on his run. Hadji, got there. Jokerez! Oh! Dozel. Oh, we stuck him out. Overlap. Colosho. He won! Finish! Ah! It's whiskers. Someone was back post. I didn't see who was back post, but I should have dinked it to back post, I think. Felt easier to play against Leverkusen. Madison. I know what you can do, though, son. Oh! Fingers. Go on. Try. Oh, he's got to go. He's got to go. Off you go, Rod. See you later, Rod. You made a rod for your own back here, lad. You've got to go. Alzheimer's ridden. Rod Stewart. See you later. Go and run yourself a nice little bubble bath. Big winner. Well up. And again. Into Harmer. Mid. Oh, over the top. Find him. Samuel finishes. Yes! No messing around. Samuel Adoze, who has been 
he's been the wizard. He's been the wizard of this rebuild. And I tell you what, he's got one more little trick that he's going to pull out of that rabbit's hat. And it could be, that could be the goal that lifts us to Premier League. I love him. He's unbelievable. He might be one of the best wingers I've ever used. Call it. Call it. Call it done. Oh, no. Oh, no. You ain't going to do this to us. Don't do it to him. Oh. Oh. Send it. Send it. Put it out of its misery. Get in the boys. Unbelievable season. It's going to be Harmer. To left. Coventry City. Premier League champions. But. There's one more game. There is one more game to play. <sighs> Champions League final. Let's have a look. Who we'll be facing. So with that then. The Premier League secure. As we look on towards the final. Stats for the season. Had you right. Top Bagsman. And Madison. Top of the assist charts. But. It's time for the big one, the Champions League final, and it's live. Oh, all right then. It's you then, is it, Barca? Standing in the way at a Sky Blues of our first Champions League trophy. We got one shot at it, but these boys, these boys look pretty good. That's not the Champions League, though, is it? What is going on here? What is going on here? They look like they've got a decent side, though. I've got to be honest. Uh, Lord Farquhar right there. He's he's stressing me out because he's got to be good, isn't he? But the rest of them, I recognise a couple faces. But they've got a great side anyway, ain't they? And we know about Colo Moane. But the Sky Blues, it's as you'd expect. So a back four of Martson, Van Ecke, Van Elwick and Mark Gay. Dovin in goal, of course. Colosho, Madison, Harmer and Adozi. And then up front, the two bad lads, the two big bad lads. It's Wright and Jokeres. Come on, boys. Come on, the Sky Blues. Champions League. we got to get it done. There's an early doors. He can strike him. And he's not scared to. Oh, Restes. Shit in. On your goalpost. Dominguez. Oh, doesn't want it in there. Scared of it. Colosha. Drive. He won. Oh, big save. Forcing them. I tell you, we've got them on the ropes here. We have absolutely got them on the ropes. Ball in there, Madison. Oh, that's terrible. Keeps it. Well done. Colosha. Can strike him. Can strike him. Oh, no. Jokeres will be in there. He will be in there somewhere. Ah. We're getting closer. We are getting closer. Keep going. Closer again. Ball in this time. Flick it on. Flick it on to Samuel. E1! Oh, it's a big block. Right, just before half time then. Ball in. Winner. Hadji! Onto it! It's in! It's Hadji right! It's the Yank! To Yank us! Straight into the lead. Settle down, settle down. Oh, it's beautiful. He's not even looking at it. Have you ever seen a no look header in the Champions League final? Neither has Hadji Wright. Come on, Kalosh. Find him. Hadji Wright. Spin off him and go. He ain't got the pace. He's not got the pace to deal with you. Jokeres, finish. Ah, come on, Jock. Jock Pierre. You know what they say about possession without penetration. It's just masturbation. Ball through. Ah. Oh, no. Colo Moani's done him. Big save, Dovin! Oh, my God. He has been absolutely... Oh, for fuck's sake. 
I knew this was coming at some point. I just wanted it to be a lot, lot later. Lord Farquad. Your mouth. He's knocked it and gone. And he is. He's in on goal. Oh my god, that's hanging, that is. Did you all not go out on the piss night before? You've been drinking Estrellas. Oh. Give us a free kick then. Madison, go on. Seal it. I dare you. I absolutely dare you. Just there. Just wang one in top bins. Just wang one. Just wang one. Ah. Jokeres. Up you get. Flicks on. A dozy. He does it. I told you. You can't bring a dozy off. Because a dozel knows when the big games are. He knows when the big moments are. And he steps up because he's a big game player. You might as well call it referee. <laughs> There was two hurdles, and the Sky Blues have absolutely leapfrogged them both. No stumbling, no falling. Because these lads, I tell ya, I say it all the time, I've fallen in love with them. And here we go, there's many, many, many boys in that team who deserve to be lifting this trophy. I tell you what, he's just going to be chucking up gang signs. Chuck them up, son. Chuck up them gang signs. But that's it then, boys. The Sky Blues rebuild is completed. If you've enjoyed it, make sure that you drop a like. Thanks for staying around to this point. Get down in the comments and tell me who I should be rebuilding next. But as always, it's much love and peace.